Hey, oh, yo. Alright, we're back. We're gonna start a new world. This is the factory. So, after a fun, fun time in the fun house, we're gonna go into the factory. So, um, so basically, once again, new stuff. Yeah. All that jazz. Uh, so, this is Perilous Pipes. And so, as you can see, one of the new enemies here is a robot. So, they're similar to a lot of the mummies from Manic Mines, except... In, except you can, I th this time you can actually rev them from, like, any side. But, yeah, but, uh, there are also some robots that have, like, their top bent, like, the top half of them bent down, so you can stomp on them, but you gotta be, like, careful. I think you can't hit, like, the spark on their, at the top of them, be or else you'll take damage. I, I mean, I don't really know this. This world also, once again, does not give me like a whole lot to say. It's just worldy. Now, um, this is actually my least favorite world in this game, but it's only for the second half, which we'll see in the next video. Um, yeah. Whoa. Careful there. Uh, went to that thing. I don't know why I stole for that long, and I gotta get back up here because it's contains something important. So yeah, as you can see, there's qu quite a bit of, like, uh, chests with pack dots and all that stuff. So, like, too big. And we're gonna not use that. There, there's an easy way to get up there. You don't necessarily need to, like, use the, uh... don't need to, like, not, like, need to necessarily use the thingamabobber. Or, I don't know what you call them. Floating pipes? I don't really know. Uh, alright, let's... Ghosts. And this one is... This one's at least easy, because it's easy to get all four ghosts here. And they're not in, like, overly tough locations. And this is a good place to get some pellets, so... Or, pack dots. Ugh. I, uh, th that's the problem, like, if you watch, like, the... 80s cartoon, than 80s Pac-Man cartoon by Hanna-Barbera, then I, you kind of get, like, used to calling them pellets instead of just pack dots, because that's, that's what they would call them, just power pellets. And instead of pack dots, even though power pellets are nowhere near as common as pack dots in this game. And I don't think there's any references to the cartoon in this game, either. Um. Alright, so we got the second day, and now we can move on. So we are at the maze, and now this to get to get the Galaxian is a little bit of a jaunt. So uh, let's just milk over there, go over there as cautiously as we can. Just make sure not to hit anything important. And there we go. There's the Galaxian. Oh no, it's glory. Stomp on these things, uh, and I'm gonna. And I'm not gonna touch that checkpoint until after I complete the maze. It's just more convenient. Now I gotta make it. Just be careful here. I don't wanna get hit by the uh, Peter Griffins. Um. Yeah. All right. Uh, there we go. Alright, let's do it. Let's do the maze. Alright, so this is the first factory maze. So the mechanic here is those Peter Griffins. Uh, shooting themselves from the pipes. Yeah, pipes. No! No! Oh, I might still have a chance. I might still have a chance. Come on. Ah, no! You know, I really should focus on getting the peach. Oh, that's real. I didn't even collect the, for, like, the first peach. Have mercy, please. Just have mercy. Ugh. Stupid ghosts keep running off. There. Oh, my goodness. Not again. Oh, there, finally. 
Alright, now to go for the peach. Well, I don't lose sight of it. Oh, there we go, just barely got it. Ugh, let's hope I can have mercy here, like uh, on the Manic Mind maze. Probably not. They're probably not gonna offer me much mercy here. Hold on. There we go. Alright, well, let's just see. Maybe they will give me some mercy. I don't know. I mean, I, I mean, I, I didn't even make it that far in terms of pack dots. Oh, darn it, no, he's rapidly taking damage. Nope! I don't think they're giving me any mercy. Wow. Wow, just, I didn't even make it that far. And no mercy. Ugh. Oh, this sucks. I believe I lost a peach. That's the second time now that I've seen that happen. Where I've lost the third fruit from dying. And I didn't even collect any fruit before I died. And it's all because I messed up collecting, trying to chomp all four ghosts with the first pellet. Ugh. Oh, this sucks. Oh, well, we're done the maze. Let's just get out of here. Sure, we can make it up in like a later level. Volt. Oh boy! All right, so now we just gotta get past all this jazz again. There we go. All righty. Now. Here, that's all the robots. Dine on some pellets. Or uh, pack dots. Uh, I keep calling them pellets. You know what? I don't really care if I call them pellets at this point. I'm just so used to the like the 80s cartoon at this point that let's just call them pellets. All right, there we go. Alright, so now, just gonna get rid of these. And then we can drop down and get some more pellets. Alright, that is go. And now we get to use the chrome ball to free some of the chests here. So, life wedge, banana, and extra life. Oh boy, alright, so let's be doing our way back up here. And jump over here. And you don't know, multiple times I've had it where I haven't where I tried to get the pallet, but I didn't latch onto the ledge, so I fell into the water and couldn't get the ghost. Let's hope that doesn't happen here. Ah, there we go. Alright. Whoa. Yeah! I didn't even touch the spark! What?! Ugh! Where's my luck? Ugh! This sucks! I'm not having a good round here. Yelling at the- Ugh! This really sucks! Whoa! Okay, I gotta be careful here. We're, uh, moving on to the end of the level, at least, so... Plus, I guess. Um. Uh, so. Whoa! Okay. Done that. The last checkpoint there, and I'm gonna get rid of this weirdo. Alright, so. Go well, first of all, I'm gonna go up here. Channel that thing. What? Hey! Don't, don't run away from me! There we go, that's more like it. Alright. Whoa, whoa! Oh, that was close. That was pretty darn close. Now, actually, there are two ghosts down there. Is a, there are two ghosts down there, and it actually is, and I have done it before. I really have gotten all four ghosts with one pellet. 
Uh, but it's gonna take a lot of timing, and it's gonna take a lot of... It's gonna be... I'm gonna have to be really quick. The ghosts are gonna have to get themselves in a pretty good position here. Darn it! Oh, they already... They had themselves in a good position, so... Okay. Come on. No! Ugh! Still have time. Come on. Come on! Come on! Ah, darn it! I missed the last one, but oh well. It was close enough. Ugh. Good luck! Today! Let's see if I can at least just cross the chasm and get the fruit. Ugh. Alright, come on, shop, old bugger. Get him out of the way. And... BAM! There we go. And now we just got some... Just got some stuff down here, and then we're done when we're done the level, so... This level wasn't too overly hard. There we go! And now we just gotta go back up. Okay? Um... Yeah, okay, that, that, that's nice, that, that's always nice. Ugh. Ugh! It, it, it's like if I hit, like, hit the edge of it or something that I take damage? I have no clue. But we're done the level anyway, so... yippee ki -yay. Ugh, let's just get out of here. And let's on to the bonus round, and this, and this isn't a hard one either. It's just running under these things. I don't know what you say. I still don't know what you call them. I'm sure somewhere knows what you call them. Uh, there we go, and now we just gotta do this, so we get some fancy, uh, fruit and pack dot collecting here. And actually, yes, finally, I called them pack dots! They should be called! Well done, 100%. yippee ki Alright, I'm not gonna care for the roulette. Got plenty of lives. Done the level. Alright, so I guess we have enough time to do another level, don't you say? Moving on. Under pressure. Uh, alright, so I mean in recent like in recent years having like I mean even though I've played this game for like the longest time, in recent like uh years now. Whenever I think under pressure, I think of that one episode of The Loud House, Undie Pressure. And for some reason, I ended up associating it with this level. Even though the two have nothing like in common. Oh! Oh! Oh. Just my luck! Oh, I, these things, they get painful after a while. Ugh. Come on! Am I just going to have no luck with killing these things without taking damage? Ugh. So, this is under pressure. Ugh. Ugh. Groan, groan, groan. This is under pressure. And as you can see, I'm not having any luck with not taking damage here. So, it's basically just the same gig as uh, Perilous Pipes. It's nothing too, uh, too different. It's just more... Stuff, I guess. Yeah, and yeah, in no way is this related to the Loud House episode, Undie Pressure, because first of all, this came like 17 years, or 16, 17-ish years before that episode even aired. Um, yeah. And yeah, in no way, and I mean, in no way does Pac-Man have anything to do with, like, the Loud House, so... Give it all up for, uh, all up for Pac-Man here. Alright. You know, considering I've been making all these fancy thumbnails for my videos, maybe I should put that in my, uh, thumbnail and that. In no way is this related to the Loudhouse episode of the same name. That'd be funny. I don't know, that would go down. Alright, get some pellets. Please. There we go. 
Yeah, I don't want these, so we're just gonna be careful here. Alright, so in regarding like to the loud house, I mean if if you if if I haven't made it like clear on like here, if, if I wasn't like if, if I wasn't vague enough, I do like the show, but it does have its like skirts. And one of them is the uh Let's just say it's the butt twerking episode. I don't like. I hate butt twerking. Just let's leave it at that. And then the gloating board game episode. That's also another one that I really, really hate. Cause it's just nothing but gloating. So you seeing a character just gloating about every victory, and they don't actually get character development. They just decide not to gloat in front of their family, which really, in the long run, doesn't like. Uh, doesn't like change anything. I mean, I mean, obviously, I, I mean, obviously, I don't care. I, I don't mind if people like the episode. I'm, I'm perfectly fine with that. I just can't see how that. I can't see how that's character development because, um, I mean, I mean, someone I know, one of my, someone I know, uh, pin. I kind of gave like a, an accurate description, like, um, or just, I don't know how to pronounce it, but someone gave like a statement that perfectly kind of describes it. Uh, they end up seriously injured, and, uh, they end up coughing up blood from every, uh, orifice. Uh, you, uh, put a bandage on the wound to treat the, uh, some of the blood, but you don't end up not treating all the blood. So, you still got a big problem on your hands, and that's basically, I kind of agree, that's how I would describe it, kind of. Uh, basically, it's solving some of the problem, but not all of the problem. And I'm at low health here. Oh, and if you don't know, the episode name is Leonard Takes All. should mention that to make to like, clear it up. And the butt twerking episode is called Come Sail Away. Um, but, uh, it's, it's funny because the, I think the only reason I'm talking about The Loud House now is because it just so happened that I'm in a level that has a similar title to one of the episodes. Uh... Alright, uh, boy, so collecting more pack dots here. This is the second time where we're gonna be from pipe, collecting them from, like, pipes. Right, there's an extra life at the end. I mean, obviously, like, I mean, obviously, there are some, uh, I mean, obviously, I mean, obviously, the good episodes of the Loud House definitely at least overshadow the bad ones. But there are still certain, uh, like, episodes that I, I prefer not, like, to talk about, because if I, you know, if I talk about episodes like Butterfly Effect, then I'm just gonna, that's just gonna give me bad memories of, uh, end of 2016 and the, uh, little, um, little rant video I did back in, uh, September. Uh, Alright, uh, I think. It. We are up to the Galaxian Maze now. Let's hope I can have better luck with this one than the last level. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to chance it. I'm done. Yeah! Nope! No, 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 nope. Yeah. I'm just going to... I'm still faithfully pass away here. Uh. Yeah. There we go. Now we just get in here. Alright. So... Alright, so this time I'm hopefully I'm gonna have learned better luck than like last time. And I think I'll probably get all the ghosts here. <laughs> Just my luck, and, and the fruit here is I'm in an apple. So basically it's the same obstacle, but uh, instead of from the walls, the, uh, the uh, Peter Griffins pop up from the floor. I guess it's just a little. <sighs> no, I really gotta stop touching these ghosts. I heard touching ghosts aren't good for you. There's. <sighs> the other apple. So, yeah, so far I am having a much better luck here than on Preparalous Pipes. <sighs> you know, the apples here are just like the ghosts in a way. They try to run away from you. If they see you. Well, no, actually, that's the opposite of the ghosts. If you approach a ghost, then they turn around and try to go after you. Oh, well, lucky me, there's only apples. Or, the last apple, in fact. And there we go, got cornered by a ghost. Ugh. 
you know, uh, back, you know, back to the, I, I don't know how this got, like, in, into a discussion about the Loud House instead of the actual game, but I guess it's better than me being, like, going on a blank or something. I mean, easily, I could probably, like, do, I could, uh, I don't know how to pronounce it, but, oh, come on, at least let me get a, ah! Uh, great way to end. I mean, m most of the characters, like, I don't, like, necessarily, like, I don't, uh, most of the characters I'm perfectly fine with, uh, in a way, at least, but the one character I do hate is, uh, Lin, because of, uh, Ego, <laughs> really, all our character seems to be is just, oh, Ego, and oh, oh, vi um, gloating about every victory, and oh, uh, superstition, and oh, all that, and oh, just overly competitive, and nothing more, it's just, no. I mean, and I could easily, like, she she could easily, like, be like, to, and that's one of the reasons why I really hate Linner Takes All, and you could easily compare a light to the Scout from, like, Team Fortress 2, but the, at least the Scout from Team Fortress 2 has more creative, more creative gloating lines, and he's actually, at least he's doing his job because he cares about his team. Literally, in, in particularly in that episode I just mentioned, literally all Lin, like, has in terms of glowing is just shouting, like, chicken dinner and just all that, and it's nothing. And I've heard, like, I've heard, I've heard claims, like, that she's, that she's supposed to be annoying, that she was written to be annoying, but to me that doesn't really alleviate her in the slightest. I mean, I'm not a person who's going to automatically sympathize with a character just because they're supposed to be annoying. Okay, so, off, well, now off that discussion, now I, I'm going to try and get the sharks here. Hopefully, there we go. Come on. There you go, little bugger. No, i got to get this. Any other shark will appear. Nope, i got to instead get the extra life. Alright, so now that that has gotten, now I can go back up. Man, to the rest of the level. Alright. So down there, you can see the M. We're gonna get that eventually. There we go. Ah! No, no, no! I touched a pipe! One of those steamy hot pipes. Ugh. There we go. Alright, so... And again, we touch a pipe. That's real nice. Well, at least we're out of the... Ugh. No, no, no! Ah, now I have to go all the way back here because of the shark. The the mechanical shark, I should add. I don't think there's a real sharks, but... Ah! So now it's slow, slow, go, go, go. Swim, swim, swim. Ah! This is painful. This sucks. This is gonna take a while. Ugh. No, 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 I shouldn't even try and be chancing it. That's stupid. If anything, I should be trying to stay away from these sharks. Oh, there we go. Come on! There. Alright. Come on! No, no! There we go. Alright, so... Pretty close to the end here, at least. Oh boy, so this is gonna be tricky. I really, I really don't. Th these like Peter Griffins come in and come in those random times, just like that. See, and like that. So now we're gonna go back up. Well, we got in the second day, and we're gonna dodge some more Peter Griffins. Fun, fun. Fun! Oh, at least let me make it up there. Come on. Don't let myself get hurt. There we go. 
and get an extra life. And pummel that rod. Without- WOW! The one time I'm at low health and I pummel it without dying by stomping on it. What luck. Um. Alright, let's- Oh! Oh, wow. Wow, that's just- No, that's just real- Really, really sad. No, 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 like- No! Come on. Jump. Okay. Alright, so this is gonna be a little bit of a toughie here, so... We've got pellets and ghosts. I, does ghosts even appear? I think they only- No, wait. They're right there. Uh, so... Activating this thing does some stuff, so it makes the pellet to chomp them appear, but this is gonna be difficult because at the same time I gotta avoid these falling uh, the fallen debris. So and they're exactly like those obstacles in the ruins mazes and that they can stop you. No! No! Not again! No! Why? Ah! Uh, what? What I'm done here! I'm just having no luck with the factory! I've just had a slew of bad luck here. Ugh. This is pathetic. Someone, anywhere, give me mercy. Like, please. This is torturous. I'm sick of taking damage to all these weirdos. Ugh. At least I did relatively well enough in the maze, so I guess it doesn't really matter. I don't know. Ugh. Just get the bonus round over with. Hopefully that'll do us some, like, plenty good. If any. Hopefully I can get over 50,000. Ugh, but I guess we'll have to see. Yeah, I think we're safe. Pretty certain. Well, at least when we get to the weigh-in machine, we'll probably keep that mark. Alright, there we go. So, no luck, Packy man today. Alright. Gonna skip the roulette. Yeah, well, at least I made it over 50,000, so I guess it's not all bad. <sighs> Alright, well, be dope, be do. So, we'll see you guys next time for the next level. And the next level has a bit of a history with me, so goodbye.